What's going on, yo? She Rock LD, you already know we in the yard. Silver Surfer. It's going down tonight. Repping the real. Eight o'clock, YouTube. Trapping in NYC in the 80s. It's gonna be the crazy epic stories. J.O. Davey, what's going on? I see y'all. Y'all stay showing love to the kid. Tonight, repping the real. Trapping in the 80s. I got the crazy stories for y'all. The crazy official, official stories for y'all. Again, trapping in the 80s. We're going to be talking about the OGs. The teenagers who became millionaires. The dudes that got locked up forever and they still locked up. How how dudes was trapping back then. The rules, the regulations, the dudes that don't know, you already know we going in. Y'all got to tune in. It's going to be epic. Crazy epic. We're going to be talking about all the 80 babies. I want all my 80 babies there. And if you wasn't an 80 baby and you happen to be one of the young bucks, tune in and listen how we was giving it up in the 80s. The 80s was the most dangerous, the most money, the most deadliest decade in NYC. Those that know, know. The 80s was the most deadliest, the most murderous, the most money. The whole decade, the 80s was the most violent decade in NYC. You already know, the Bronx. I'm going to be talking mainly about the X. I wasn't really too familiar with Brooklyn back then. So I'm gonna need my OGs to hit me up with info on the Brooklyn yo on the Brooklyn dudes. I want to know about the OGs from Brooklyn, from Queens, from Manhattan, all that NYC. It's all about NYC tonight, especially the X. I want everybody to tune in. It's gonna be on my YouTube channel. My YouTube channel is Charlie Rock LD, repping the real. You already know. Siempre el solo, Antonio, BX, ya tu sabes, my bodies. Tonight, I want everybody to tune in. It's going to be a live stream on YouTube. My YouTube channel is Charlie Rock LD, repping the real. In case you're a motherfucking dinosaur and you don't know where your boy's at, you heard? It's going to be epic. I got the crazy story for y'all. I guarantee you it's going to be a hell of a show, yo. Cypress, Ants, Brooke Ab, Willis, you already know. 138. 138 in Brooke. Dudes don't know about 138 in Brooke. We're going to be talking about Blondie, Calderon. Your boy, boy George. Chicky, Little Pauly, Eddie Ed. I'm going to hit you with the exclusive stories, yo. Y'all got to tune in tonight. Repost. Make sure y'all share this. Let everybody know. Your boy C-Rock LD is in the yard. Repping the real. Gun Hill. You already know. 263rd. Free Boy George. My nigga Boy George been locked up since 88, my niggas. That's crazy. Your boy C-Rock did many, many years. But these dudes been locked up since 88. We are in 2002, pushing 2023, and these dudes are still locked up, my niggas. That's crazy, man. My heart goes out to them. 
That's why today I'm on some other shit, man. I enjoy my freedom every day. Always remember, no matter how bad the day gets, whatever hardship your ass is going through, every day above ground is a good one. Every day above ground is a good one. So until that casket drop, y'all make sure y'all live every day like it's your motherfucking last. You heard? Rock with your boy, C-Rock LD. We in the yard, my nigga. I'm over here at Stop It Shop, ready to go to commissary. Ah! <clears throat> I'm ready to go to commissary. <clears throat> Stop It Shop, right there. On the commissary. Ha <laughs> ha! 167 and Taylor. Rich from the Bronx. ¿Qué pasa, mi hermano? ¿Cómo está? I want everybody to repost this. Let people know we're going down tonight. YouTube, Charlie Rock LD, repping the real. 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock. <clears throat> My podcast has been going crazy. The last jump off I did is No The Real Fat Joe. That shit is doing crazy numbers right now. It is what it is. <clears throat> Rock with your boy. We in the yard. Bronx stopping shop. No, I'm not in the Bronx, homie. Your boy is not in the X. I'm in a undisclosed area. You know I can't tell niggas where I be at. We ain't gonna have no pop smoke. No P and B episode over here. I'm not telling niggas where I'm at. You crazy? <laughs> we gotta keep that on the low. Twelve twenty seven Phantom. Don't be blowing me up, yo. Don't blow me up, yo. Your niggas is blowing me up. <laughs> Rock with your boy, man. I love this podcast shit, man. I mean, I really get off on talking to people and people hitting me up, the comments and all that. I really enjoy that. For those that don't know, your boy is also a mentor. I mentor young kids. I'm mentoring a, a, a 13-year-old right now. I really feel great molding his mind and helping him look at life through a different lens you know, the older you get, the wiser you get, or usually that's how it goes, man. So I love the fact that I'm giving back to the community, man. Today, your boy is a positive person in the community. Believe it or not, man. Eddie Gatz, que pasa? I want all y'all checking in. All y'all got to check in tonight, 8 o'clock, YouTube. I want your everybody checking in tonight on YouTube. My YouTube channel is Charlie Rock LD repping the real. Charlie Rock LD repping the real. Make sure you're subscribed, man. I need to get those subscriptions up so I can start monetizing and get the motherfucking bag, yo. Can I get the bag? Can a boy live? Can I get the motherfucking bag? Ha! <laughs> Roll up radio. <clears throat> What's going on? You got to promote me on your jump off, man. Charlie Rock LD repping the real. Y'all already know. I need y'all to subscribe. Like and subscribe. Donations are also welcome. Don't be stingy, motherfuckers. Donations is also welcome. I need commissary. My cash app is dollar sign Charlie Rock LD. Dollar sign, Charlie Rock LD, Cash App. Your boy, I got to keep the commissary up, yo. Fuck eating them oodles and noodles and all that. I'm trying to eat steak and lobster. So you already know. Tune in. J-Rock, what you saying? I make a hype man, nigga? You think I'm a motherfucking hype man? <laughs> How you going to call me a motherfucking hype man, yo? Yo, I just got the fresh cut. What y'all niggas think? Should I stick with this barber or not? Did he lace me up or what? Did this barber lace me up or what, man? Or do I need to find a new barber?
I think I think the barber did a good job, man. Haircuts is crazy expensive nowadays. I liked it better when I was paying a pack of cigarettes for a haircut. Ha! Fuck what you heard, nigga. A pack of cigarettes for a haircut. That's how it was going down on the inside. Or five stamps. Either five stamps or a pack of smokes. These niggas now want $30, $40, $50. Fuck out of here. You do house visits for cuts. Okay, get at me. Charlie Rock LD, prison mentality at gmail.com. Anybody that want to hire at me on a personal level, my email is uh, Charlie Rock LD, prison mentality at gmail.com. Niggas asking me where the Hummer at. The Hummer's gone. The Hummer been gone. Your boy got the V, though. I'm pushing. I'm pushing a little something. It ain't the Bentley. It ain't the Range Rover, but I'm pushing a little something. Your boy ain't walking. I'm in there. I just don't like to show the whip. I told you, we ain't having another Pop Smoke episode in here. All that showing the whip and the house and... Where you at, where you the girl, my daughter, my kids. Nah, I don't show none of that on, online. Fuck that. You won't catch C-Rock lacking. Val the Boys, what's going on, man? I always see you repping, man. My boy Val the Boys, the, Val the Boys is always repping, man. I appreciate that. You stay repping your boy. Joe never gave me a Hummer. That nigga's, that nigga's capping. Like you young people say, he's capping. The nigga talking about, he blessed me with a Hummer and an apartment. He's lying. The nigga gave me $1,000 when I came home. That's what he gave me. The nigga straight capping. I did have a Hummer. The Hummer was 42000 Joe blessed me with 4000 That's what he did. Keeping it official. Yo, the Hummer was 42, 43,000, and Joe blessed me with 4,000, and your boy put up the rest. No capping. All like that, he brought me a Hummer. Get the fuck out of here, yo. Nigga talking about he brought me a Hummer. Yeah, the same way you gave Pun's wife they, fan, they, 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 they money, right? If you didn't hit Pun's family off, and that nigga made you millions and made you famous, you, you really think you're going to buy me a Hummer? Fuck out of here, my nigga. Whatever I got, I got on my own. He said he bought Cuban a house. <laughs> my nigga said he bought Cuban a house. Yo, believe that shit? Straight capping. I even heard one interview where he said he gave everybody 500000 each. I'm not worried about Joe showing me love. Fuck Joe. I do not need Joe to show me love. I'm that nigga. I stay in the yard. I get my own shit. Even when I was with Joe, I was getting my own shit. Yeah, he'll bless me with a couple of thousands here and there when I was down with him. But nothing crazy. You know what I mean? No call with me. Taking no call. You come. So yeah, everybody remember tonight is going down, Reppin' The Real. My YouTube channel, Charlie Rock LD, Reppin' The Real. We gonna, we gonna be talking about trapping in the 80s. I got the crazy stories for y'all. I got the crazy, exclusive, epic stories for y'all. We gonna go down memory lane. And if you're a young blood and you wanna know how we was giving it up in the 80s, you gotta tune in. If you trapping out there now and you want to know how they was giving it, I uh, don't condone it. I'm not condoning trapping. But if that's what you're doing, I love my birds. I love birds. But if that's what you're doing and you're trapping and you want to know how they was giving it up in the 80s, you got to tune in tonight. Charlie Rock LD, repping the real. You already know. The prison mentality shirts. Check out the hoodies. 
we still got the prison mentality uh, merchandise going on. For all my people that been inside and want to rep they set and let the world know that they survivors, you got to cop the original Charlie Rock LD. Look, it says Charlie Rock LD, prison mentality. Rock with your boy, we in the yard. Y'all sleeping on the gear. We got the official gear. Prison mentality. We got hoodies. We got mugs. We got the wife beaters, the pink one for the females, because females do they think too. We got to recognize the, the female OGs. There's definitely a lot of female OGs out there, you heard? It's not just the dudes. My boy City Swift on the boss records. You already know my boy City Swift is in here. Y'all got to check City Swift out. My boy City Swift was uh, one of my artists when I was banging out with the uh, Underboss Records slash entertainment. We even did a joint together called um, Underboss Records, Cra uh, Underboss Anthem, featuring Charlie Rock and City Swift. Y'all got to peep that. City, make sure y'all check out the podcast tonight, yo, 8 o'clock on YouTube. Charlie Rock LD repping the real. Again, I need y'all to subscribe, 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 comment, like, all that good shit. The Big Yard, you already know. <clears throat> it's fucking nice out here, yo.